awakening to reality is now generally accepted because like the English word mindfulness has become of common use in the Western society, in psychology and science. They talk about teaching mindfulness in primary schools, high schools, to the military, to the parliament. It's a word that is overused now. And of course, people criticize this sometimes because, you know, in order to rob a bank, you have to be mindful. And to commit a successful crime, you know, to murder somebody and get away with it, it takes a great deal of mindfulness to be able to do that. But is that what I mean when I use the word, or what the Buddha meant? So mindfulness is our ability to open to the present moment in, in this sense of sati and sampatanya. These are the two Pali words we use. Sati is to remember this moment. You kind of awake in the here and now. And then sampatanya is to receive all that exists in this present moment. Uh, it's, it's not choosing any particular object. It's not focusing or concentrating on an object of any sort, but this kind of broad spectrum of awareness that is receptive, sati sampatanya. And then the, the foundation for this isn't based on desire to rob a bank or commit a murder. The foundation is based on baramitas or virtues, uh, good intentions, uh, meritorious actions. We have dana sila. Dana is the word for generosity. To be able to help others, share what we have with others, uh, not to be selfish and stingy is uh, developing Dhanabharamita. Sila is to take responsibility, translated as five precepts, morality. What it means is to take on responsibility for how you live in the society, to refrain from saying or doing things that in any intentional way that cause unnecessary harm deceit or suffering to anyone else or to oneself. We're educated people, so we have a lot of knowledge. We've acquired a lot of knowledge about everything external. You know, so we study science, psychology, philosophy, history, you name it. We acquire knowledge always from books, from teachers, from traditions. So what we learn in modern education is acquired knowledge. It's knowledge that we grasp that comes to us from outside. With sati sampachanya, with mindfulness, then there's wisdom developing. It means wisdom in this sense of Buddha wisdom isn't about knowing everything about everything. It's not about being God up in the heavens, knowing everything that's going on everywhere all the time. It's knowing the way things are.